Good afternoon. This is Mayor Marshall Claire, and we're just really excited about being selected as a Connecticut hero. Since taking office, we had a series of, of weather-related incidents. The first was Storm Alfred, which dropped a significant amount of snow and shut down roads and brought winter conditions that the town hadn't seen before, the state hadn't seen before in a number of years. And then we had a hurricane, then we had an earthquake, and then we had the October snowstorm that shut the state down. Fortunately for us in the town of East Hartford, we were able to early on assess that it was imperative that all of my directors knew how to run the Emergency Operations Center, to be a part of an integral role during an emergency experience. We also expanded the way we communicate with our public. The last line of communication that we had would be through an important messaging system. So purchasing the Everbridge expanded system would enable us to be in touch with our residents at any time with the stroke of a few fingers and even from our iPhones. During the October 21st snowstorm, we wanted to make sure that our residents had the food that was necessary uh, to sustain them during the continued time without electricity. Through a volunteerism, we were able to pull together a network of people to be at East Harford High School to hand off over 100,000 ready-made meals to the residents of our community. We know that the weather changes and the weather patterns are changing and East Harford is prepared. The team that the mayor has put together from, from every department and every director and their abilities and their capabilities and what they bring to the table to allow the community to respond to and recover from significant events, whether it's in a weather event or something else, that's why we are successful. So, you know, we've, we figured out a way to do that and, and, you know, it took a little bit of innovation, a little bit of collaboration. Red Cross approached us and said, we'd like some help developing a program, an educational program for people with hearing def deficiencies. So we teamed the CERT team and American Red Cross together and worked on that training program for them. So we reached out to the American Red Cross and through the mayor and the council got our, our shelter designated as a regional shelter, which provides us ready access to all that American Red Cross has to offer. Working together, we can accomplish more. And we're just happy to have had that experience and had great outcomes as a result. So thanks to the American Red Cross and all that they do in our community and how they came forward to help us during these times, um, we will always remember that.